Um, my name is Sophia Burton. Um, I'm in ninth grade, and I'm from Bellevue East. Hip hip. Hooray! This this poem is called "The Storm." My small head lays against the couch cushion. I close my eyes. I think my small, small head thinks if there was a way to die without pain, if I could just flick a switch, I, I would. I woke up that day. I went to school. I was having an amazing day with my friends and teachers, unassuming. My dad picked me up early. We walk home. My dad's quiet. Now, I might have had a small head, but my thoughts were as large and as complex as the luring storms in the sky. I ask questions. Did something happen? Did one of the pets die? He doesn't answer. Did mom die? He shakes his head. We keep walking. When we get home, she's, she's gone. He lied. She's dead. My brother and dad hug. They try to hug me, but I'm nothing to be held. Touching me, a storm will not calm me and will only hurt you. I continue on. My mind is growing more complex, twisting, a twisting storm of updrafts and rotating winds, I, but I am quiet. When I'm not, I hiss or cry. I pretend to be an animal with my friends on the playground because it's the only thing close to being a free storm. Rolling across an open field, twisting and turning, I was a supercell of sadness, confusion, and anger. I could form a tornado at any moment and cause damage that would never be fixed. As I age, my intricate gusts and flanks are held together in my small but growing head. I'm still quiet, even though I'd like to scream. Scream as loud as the wind of, of tornadoes passing by. They sound like freight trains and jets. I envy them because of my silence, their beauty and voice and way of taking up space. And they die so quietly, as I wish to, as I wish she did. One moment they are destroying everything in sight, the next they are gone. They feel no pain, they just dissipate. I, I, wish to, I had wished to dissipate into an open field of broken fences, barns, and lifted cars, but I could only lay on a couch and wish to turn off. I've grown into a tangled mess of calm fog and raging shelf clouds, unbalanced but still together, only mixing into a thunderstorm when I need it the least. Hurting one's close, loved ones, hated ones. Being a storm has never helped me.